Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Today my battery is gonna die. Blip. Today I am going to just hope my charger, I mean my battery doesn't run out of battery because I don't have a battery charged. Anyways. <laughs> Today we are going to a lumber yard. Very exciting. Well, I think it's a lumber yard. I actually have no idea. We're going to some person's place from Facebook that is selling wood. We are gonna show you guys a little living room DIY, and then I'm gonna do the house tour because then our living room will be done. So, we're gonna show you how we make this bench. We're making a bench. And then I'm gonna do like a gallery wall and a lot of fun things. So, stick around and don't forget to subscribe down below if you like this video and like it if you want um but let's go to the lumber yard also Forrest invited himself <laughs> he wanted to enjoy the rainy day it was definitely someone's house but we got our wood and now we're going to the home depot let us go i don't even know what we're getting but i feel like that's like every home depot trip so here we go okay pro tip go to home depot's garden look at this monstera look at how beautiful this rubber tree is i i honestly might have to get this i told evan i shouldn't come in here because i shouldn't buy a plant because it's torture that's so rude we got what we needed plus an air filter and now we go sand the piece of wood that we got and that is the next step in this process Okay, so it is the next day. I took my flower card out this morning. Evan is washing his hands. That is so bright. But we sanded some more today, Evan did. And yesterday we just like sanded it a couple of more times. And now Evan just put a layer of the polyurethane on it to seal it all up. Very professional setup on a chewy box. There it is. You can kind of see like the cuts from where the wood was cut because it was a tree <laughs> it was an actual tree but it looks very beautiful okay day three of this vlog this is longer than i thought and i feel like it's not very cohesive at all but basically we're still making the bench it's still happening um and we actually are doing a couple other things so this is yeah i'm just showing you guys how i'm going to be decorating the little living room area um i just went to the thrift store I will take a little break in the DIY process and show you what I got. So I got this basket for upstairs on our dresser and I think these are really cute. Evan doesn't like them, but I think they're cute. I got a parking ticket. I got this nice looking family white frame. I got this pot, cause I feel like I only have terracotta pots so I need a different ones. And I'm gonna put this plant in it, but also, do you see all, all of what's happening? I need to figure that situation out. But this needs to be lifted a little because, like, it's a little too low. Um, and then I also got this one. Still terracotta, but it's a little bit different texture. And I also got that basket right there. We are also sanding this um, picture frame to be lighter wood. It was kind of like a weird wood. And it still is a little weird, but it looks better than what it was before. I am also painting this black frame white so it'll like match better with our gallery wall. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Yay, all four legs are on. Very happy. Good job. Yay. We're going 
to the living room. Not quite the full home tour, but I'm going to show you guys how I decorate this. Okay, so I should have filmed this, but I didn't. I just took all of the plants out of our little plant corner that we had. Let me show you. So I just moved them all. It was honestly very chaotic. I'm not sure if we're gonna keep this or sell it or move it somewhere else. I don't know quite yet. Sometimes when you're decorating and it's something that sounds super simple like hanging pictures or an open shelf That's the hardest. So right now I stopped because I feel like I want to hang the photos That are going right here. Oh my gosh, right? Oh my gosh. What the heck? Okay, never mind hanging the photos above the bench. I think I need to do that first to then get a better sense of like if I want this to be just a plant bench, I'm gonna just see. Oh, <laughs> it all depends on my plants. But I think it looks very cute. I'm very excited, almost as cute as my hair. I hope this vlog makes sense, to be honest. I hope you guys are getting something from this, but I'm just being real about the process and how I decorate, I guess, because decorating isn't always that easy. Sometimes I have to stop and like look at some inspo. Sometimes I have to just like stop and walk away from it or sometimes I'm like, yes, I know exactly what I want. Sometimes I think I know what I want and then, for example, like right now I thought I knew what I wanted it to look like, but turns out I don't know because sometimes interior design is a little bit tricky, but I will hang the photos. I will show you guys how I hang the photos and how I like I'm gonna set them all up and then we will go from there. But we're gonna use painter's tape to mark off the gallery um, wall so I can see all the photos and where I want them hung. I went on Pinterest and I second guessed my gallery wall but I think just stick to what you have taped off if you are doing this and oh my gosh stick to what you've taped off so far so we're gonna stick to these we didn't tape off the other ones cuz the like white frame was still a little wet and whatever but I would stick to this and then kind of like move them around as you start to hang, but this will at least give you, um, give yourself an idea. Show them your dino bone. <laughs> Anyways, this will at least give you an idea. Make sure you visualize. Like we're probably gonna save a space in between the two big ones right here so a plant can hang there from the ceiling. Um, and you can look up things before, but shouldn't have gone on Pinterest. So we're gonna start hanging now. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. So it is complete. You can't really see right now, it's overexposed. But there's like a little hole in the middle that we kept for if we have like a hanging plant, the like hanging plant to land there. Um, we, so can you guys stop? So we're either gonna, well, we'll probably get some sort of hanging plant to hang somewhere on that wall, but we also might get like this metal 
um whole air plant holder it's like this gold metal thing i don't know it's really cute i've been wanting it so that was evan's idea very good idea we might do that but i'm very ocd and i can't picture the whole wall to be done until that hole is filled so i'm gonna put can i help you i'm gonna put this little artifact uprising print um in the little hole and this is a photo from denver i think that evan took and also evan took all the photos that are on the wall but i will show you them in a second i'm gonna hang this first so we might actually put our record player right here because we forgot we had it we're testing it Okay, here's the finished product. So I actually used to have, you may have seen the dog's toys in a different basket. We did decide to put out our record player. So we're gonna see if we actually utilize it now that it's out, cause we don't ever. And we only have one record, which is Marin Morris. But Evan, you saw, or you saw our bench, little DIY, super simple. I will link um, the legs down below and to be honest, it's just a plant party featuring music, featuring or my spray bottle of water, my watering can, and then literally all of these frames we got at the thrift store. So I'd say we spent a total of like $30 on all these frames, so six frames, and they are all, they're all glass and nice. And this one we sanded, which I think it looks better. And yeah, Evan took all these photos. So that one's in Colorado. This one, is, where's the sheep? France. Um, this one's in Thailand. Colorado again, because we heart Colorado. And then Michigan. So this one is actually a photo from Japan. I'll show you. And then this one that. is a mystery right now. So you can imagine, this is the photo from when we were in Japan, so it'll be right there. It'll look very nice. And then I might move that letter board because it feels like a little bit much. So I might move it because we did have it there because it's a cute like welcome. But I don't know, might move it. That is all for this week's video. It's a little bit kind of chaotic because we expected to get it done earlier, but as you saw, it took us three days. Um, and we're actually getting, I don't know if I already said this, but we're getting the like rubber floor protectors tomorrow. So we'll put those on the bench tomorrow. Um, and hopefully it'll help even it out because it is like a little bit uneven. But it looks not homemade, which was my goal. So good job, Evan and myself. And I hope you guys like this video. If you want to see more DIY videos, then comment down below. But I am doing a home tour. I know I've said it, but now that this wall is done, I officially can do it. So subscribe down below if you want to see. And that's it. Love you all. See you later. Bye. Wave. Wave bye. Good wave. Good job.